The WGC HSBC Champions is one of the premier events on the golfing calendar. With an $8.5 million prize pool, it's not surprising the world's best players have regularly featured since the tournament's inception in 2005. Here's our pick of the top 10 moments from the past eight years. At number 10 is four-time major winner Ernie Els. The Big Easy was runner-up in 2009, thanks in part to this ace at the 200-yard sixth during his second round. <laughs> Irishman Pordrick Harrington went one better the following year when he made double eagle, an albatross two on the 594-yard 14th, the first of his career. In 2006, Y.E. Yang held off the challenge of Tiger Woods to win at Shishan Golf Club. The Korean shot a final round 69 to end Woods' run of six successive stroke play victories. Phil Mickelson became the first man to win the event twice with his 2009 triumph. The key moment came on the 16th, having uncharacteristically fluffed his chip shot. Mickelson holed a 15-foot putt to save par before going on to win by a single shot. At number six is Sergio Garcia en route to victory in 2008. The Spaniard first birdied the 18th to earn a place in the playoff with Oliver Wilson before repeating the feat from twice the distance on the second sudden death hole to win. Martin Keimer's late surge in 2011 is at number five in our list. Five strokes off the lead going into the final round, this bunker shot on the seventh was the first of eight birdies in the space of 12 holes that propelled him to the first WGC win of his career. The inaugural HSBC Champions Tournament came down to a shootout between Tiger Woods and David Howell. The pair traded shots throughout the final day, but it was Howell who would become the first winner of the event. The Englishman defied the odds to defeat Woods, who is still without a win at the HSBC Champions. The 2007 tournament ended in a three-way playoff between Phil Mickelson, Lee Westwood and Ross Fisher after a final day where the lead changed hands multiple times. But it was the American who came through after the second playoff hole when Westwood found water and Fisher was unable to birdie. Mickelson holding out from five feet for his fourth win of the year. The lowest aggregate score in the HSBC Champions history belongs to 2012 winner and defending champion Ian Poulter. He made short work of the Alathaval course at Mission Hills to win by two at 21 under. But our number one moment from the past eight years of the HSBC champions is Francesco Molinari and Lee Westwood's titanic duel in 2010. The European Ryder Cup teammates were in their own personal battle all week, with Molinari holding a single stroke lead from day one. It was an advantage he maintained until the very end, when Westwood failed to convert this eagle putt, the Italian becoming the first wire-to-wire -wire winner of the event.